Today we're doing a uh, one-day workshop with PMI VRS. It was for the uh, tear adapter, as well as going over some Harkin products, the Harkin uh, Riggers winch, as well as the, uh, the Lockhead winch. So we had a lot of opportunities and a lot of scenarios that we set up in a very small amount of time that gave people some exposure to how these products are not just great standalone products by themselves, but how you can integrate them into systems and they can uh, really change the game in terms of what you're able to accomplish uh, with minimal amounts of gear, minimal amounts of folks. The stuff we're showing today, you know, the tear adapter and the winches, there's things that we feel personally are progressive in the way that the industry is going. Innovation is a key aspect to what we do. If we want to save lives as technology advances, um, we need to stay on top of cutting edge uh, trends that happen in the industries. And winches, being uh, introduced to the rescue scene and to the access scene have definitely caught folks' attention. The products they're introducing to the market right now um, are innovative. They're innovative, they're new, they're, they're, they're progressive items. They're not, not your standard things that's trying to go off of somebody else's design and make it better. It's almost a completely different product uh, that's allowing, going into the market, that's allowing us to do our jobs you know, more efficiently, safely. Who here is comfortable with winch operations, especially with uh, the drill? Has anybody had much experience with that? Dale? All right. We've got, you know, how many wraps do we have on here? We've got three. So we probably could have done two. And the fewer wraps you have, um, the easier it is for the lowering. It tends to be less jerky because there's less friction on the drum. But if Nathan ate a lot for breakfast and he weighed four or five hundred pounds. We would want to probably move that up to three or four wraps on this, and four is the max. So two is the minimum, four is the max. People want to know why I should use this versus this. You know, and that's one of the things we need to portray that we see is like, yeah, like you can you can have ten guys, or you could have a Harkin Riggers winch with a drill and have one guy facilitate the same rescue or the same same outcome. A lot of them had that kind of light bulb moment like, oh, I could use this for this, or I could use this for this, or this would take the place of, you know, multiple things I already have in my equipment cache instead of, instead. I think it's great. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think it's great. I think that it take a load off. I mean, if you're on a 12-hour shift and you're raising and lowering people all day long, I mean, you can use that drill and it makes things 10 times easier. After today, I, I'm thinking of all the different jobs we could have used both devices on. I, I'm almost uh, certain we'll be utilizing it next week. 